How's everybody doing today? Keto family, Matt Joyce here. And today I'm going to show you how to make keto donuts from scratch. I'm going to show you how to make these, but first, don't forget to hit that subscribe button followed by the bell. So you'll be notified every time I release a new video. And also, please feel free to share this out with anybody you feel would benefit from watching this video. Anybody you want, you have my permission. Sharing is caring, guys, and we're all in this together. And don't forget to check the description of this video. You'll see the recipe along with the directions on how to make this incredible keto dessert. This video was suggested by a few of my longtime subscribers. Cullum Jess Islip, The Cheapest Heat, Ed Nuts 619, and Suvankar Pudel. Thank you so much for being a longtime support of this channel. This is for you guys and everyone else around the world. And if you have a video suggestion, leave it in the comment section down below. If it's a good idea for a video, I'll make a video on it and give you credit right in that video. All right, so let me show you how to make these right now. All right, what we're gonna need is one cup of almond flour, a third cup of coconut flour, a quarter cup of keto sweetener. I'm using Boca Sweet, a quarter cup of Hershey's cocoa, four eggs, one teaspoon of baking powder, and a half teaspoon of arrowroot starch. One teaspoon of vanilla extract, a dash of salt, and two tablespoons of coconut oil. We're gonna combine these into a large mixing bowl. And mix until combined. All right, the mixture's been mixed thoroughly. Now we're going to transfer this onto a silicone pan and place it into the oven. I've got my new silicone pan here, specifically designed for donuts. I'm just going to place some coconut oil on the bottoms. All right, and with some wet hands, just form the donuts in the molds. All right, we're gonna place this into the oven, preheating at 350 degrees for approximately 15 to 20 minutes. All right, 15 minutes later and the donuts are done. Now we're going to let these cool for approximately 30 minutes before removing from the silicone mat. All right, it's been approximately a half hour, so let's take these donuts out of the mold. Look at that. Look at these donuts, they look so professional. They come right out of the mold. Perfect. I'm definitely going to get some more of these molds. This was very easy to do. Very easy to do. So these molds are incredible, these silicone molds. The link is in the description if you want to check it out on Amazon. Keto donuts. I can't wait to try these. I love donuts growing up. Mmm, these are delicious. These taste just like a chocolate donut. Without the sugar, without the carbs. This is legit, guys. This tastes incredible. Look at that, it's so dense and moist too. 
This is incredible. This would go great if you dunk it in some coffee. And this is a home run, guys. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you all be safe and be well. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And feel free to check out any of the three videos I'll link to at the end of this video. If you enjoyed this one, I am positive you're going to enjoy those. Enjoy the rest of your night. Metroid signing out. <laughs>